welcome back to my channel it's Victoria Lovelace here how are you guys I am good as usual and look what I have here I have my husband Rakul here and before I'm gonna start with this video I want to give you a little reminder to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell button because you don't want to miss all my new videos that is coming so do that and that makes me very happy so let's start and this is Dracul my husband and he's here because we are gonna do the uh, boyfriend tag or for us it's gonna be like the husband tag because we are actually married yay so it's gonna be like a little tag so i'm gonna st start with asking him different questions about our relationship and see if he remember everything because i'm not so sure if he's gonna do that so i'm gonna try him out and see if he's gonna uh, remember everything and like what he knows about me does he know me well that's gonna be interesting to see so here it is hello Draco, yeah, and you know that he also have a channel, um, Draco Grotesque, I put the link to his channel in the description, so check out his channel too, because he's also uploading YouTube videos, so you should definitely do that, so now we are gonna start, so we're gonna ask the first question, and the first question is, where did we meet? So do you remember that? Where did you meet? I know you do. Yeah, we met at a gossip club in Los Angeles. Yeah. Twenty sixteen, around August twenty seventh or twenty sixth. Does he remember where you go? Because of course I remember that, and you guys already know probably mm -hmm. when we met. That was when I was in LA uh, and with Adora and Simon, and we were recording. Uh, our LA adventure. You probably guys have seen that video on Adora's channel uh, from our LA adventure. So if you haven't, you should definitely check them out. That's where, where we met, but I don't think you are in those videos. No, you're not. Mm -hmm. No. Uh, but yeah, we met at a club in Los Angeles uh, in 2016. That's crazy. It's almost four years ago. Dang. Crazy, crazy, crazy. It will be like in two months. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. And uh, there we met. Yeah. And we're gonna move on to the second question. Um, where was your first date? You remember that? Yes, I know where I was. Where was it? Round table pizza. Yes, it's true. Round table pizza. Yeah. That was true. And when were that? When was that? That was in. Uh, 2018, yeah, November. Uh, November. Yeah, that's true. Uh, we were <laughs> not so fancy, but it was so nice. The I mean, food was the, good. the food was good, and he always showed me to different restaurants in LA that I haven't been to. So I love that that he always doing that. I really, really like that, and you show me a lot of nice restaurants. Yeah. Uh, question number three. Uh, uh, what was your first impression of me? What was that? What was my first impression? What did you like like about me? I guess. Um, your creativity, uh, politeness, honesty. Oh, that's nice. Well, that's very nice. Yeah. Before I met you, obviously, I already knew your creativity. So. So my creativity. That's what you like like it <laughs> well you see pictures online so mm -hmm. and you capture a few things here and there but when you meet in person that's when you notice other things yeah so that's good creativity honesty yeah <laughs> being nice <laughs> yeah oh that's very Respectful. nice yeah. that's very nice yeah i mean uh, I kind of like the same. I love his creativity. Look, his makeup is also, as I was saying, I think I said in another video that I love that. He's so, uh, and I love, he's a musician and he plays guitar and he has a band and that's so nice. Uh, I mean, uh, he's awesome. I mean, creativity is very attractive. I love that. So, yeah, uh, that's 
And look, it's so beautiful, beautiful, look at it, it's so beautiful, yeah. Uh, okay, uh, let's move on to the next question. Uh, when did you meet uh, the family? My family, do you remember that? Yeah. Well, I met your family in uh, late winter of 2018. Mm -hmm. And where? I met uh, your father in Stockholm, Sweden. Mm -hmm. We had dinner together. Yeah. And uh, you met my family in Thanksgiving of 2018. Yeah, I met. I mean, I lived in LA, so of course it was. Of course, I met his family first. I was the one that met his family first, and his family is Mexican, uh, Mexican American, and my family is from Sweden. So of course, it's like a lot of like culture, dif culture different, like Very between different, yeah. our families. Because I mean, uh, I mean, your family they speak like Spanish, and so I cannot really talk to them. That's the thing. So it kind of sucks. Uh, they only speak Spanish. So I really, really have to work on my Spanish, which I'm doing right now. I'm taking Spanish class so we really can communicate with his family because right mm. now it's a little bit hard. And you are taking also Swedish class. Uh, you're not taking Swedish class, but you are learning Studying Swedish, Swedish. in uh, Duolingo, uh, mm. which I wish I was better on, but unfortunately I don't do that. Uh, but I have to have to do that. I have to start doing that. Uh, so I mean, but you are studying Swedish, but. I mean, That's my family, uh, they like, they speak English very good, so I mean, that's really I guess bad. actually for correction, I think I met your father, it was after New Year's, so mm -hmm. it could have been around January, around your birthday, January 5th, January 7th, um, yeah, I think so, so yeah, the first, oh. maybe first 10 days of, of being there, so yeah, 2019, yeah, that's I, true, I, I got there, like, few hours before, before New, New Year's. Year's. Yes, yeah, I remember so, that. That, yeah, was, that so. was crazy. We went there, they like together there and it was, yeah. And, and well, you always want to go to Sweden, right? Mm, yeah, yeah, like for a long time. And I mean, the, the thing is that you, um, have you met my dad before my mom, right? Yeah, your mama didn't meet her in winter. I met her uh, Swedish summer. Oh yeah, it wasn't the summer. You weren't able Last to drive summer, up. Last summer, yeah, to Luleå because my family they live in like different parts of Sweden. Ten hours so away. It's like can be hard. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, let's move on to the next question. Uh, do I have any weird obsession? If so, what? <laughs> Everything becomes your obsession. Anything. <laughs> if it's. Uh, school homework if it's makeup if it's hair if it's anything dark bats uh anything that's gothic becomes your obsession obsession that's why your makeup is good that's why your looks always you, you don't let them lag behind you always oh, have to be yeah. obsessed with everything that you do so you perfect it so it could be able to always at the best you know well, yeah, I mean, I am, um, that's, that's actually kind of true. I get obsessed with everything. I get like crazy with everything. It's like, I'm like to a perfectionist, I guess. That's like, no, oh, yeah. Well, that's a good thing because you <laughs> yeah. always do what you do at, at its best potential instead of doing something half. Yeah, I mean, I'm trying at least. I mean, I'm trying like to... to the best of everything uh, okay let's move on to the next question um how long have we been together i think we already kind of answered that question already november 2018 yeah november 2018 so we're going on two years two years already in november yeah crazy. crazy yeah well we already answered that question so let's move on to the next one um do you have a tradition or tradition with your girlfriend or boyfriend Tradition? Tradition. Do we have any tradition? Take uh, you to my favorite restaurants and my favorite places. Uh, my yeah. Favorite, if it's a hiking trail, if it's a restaurant. If, which we can't really do right now, which is kind of sucks. I, I guess mean, my, my, my hangout spots, like with my friends, that's... Yeah. You have basically gone through all that real fast, I mean. Yeah, we have. Do we so. have any tradition? I mean... Do we... Uh, we don't really have a tradition besides always trying different foods or different places. Yeah. No, not really a tradition. No. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe dressing up goth or... 
weekend. The weekend yeah. or going extreme. I don't think there's a tradition. Yeah. I guess maybe that, that comes along after some time after of being married. Time, yeah, maybe. Yeah. Maybe that, that can be asked uh, in 15 to 20 years. <laughs> we make a, we, we will make our yeah. own traditions together. Yeah, we have to. So <laughs> that's kind of hard to just, yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, this one is probably gonna be easy, I think. Um, what was your first road trip? What was our first road trip? Was it? We Las have Vegas? been on so many road trips. Was Ooh, it Las Vegas? Las Vegas last year, I think it was. Las Vegas with my. Well, the Ooh. road trip was Sweden. Yeah, but I think Las Vegas, and then we were at the Redwoods. Redwoods. Well, well, the thing is, I don't know if that count because my mom and my sister were that was with us too. It's still a road trip. Well, it was still a road trip together. Yeah, that that's what was Redwood so, for us so we'll, because yeah, that was it, the first. It was my mom's uh, dream destination to go there, so I guess that's what we ended up to go when my mom was here. <laughs> and she took a piece of. Uh, Redwood, redwood. <laughs> tree. Yeah, and I think you also carved in the in the redwood tree like V heart uh, R. Yeah. Oh, that was so cute. See. Oh, that was so cute. I love that. Yeah, we have to go back and see if it's still there. So that was our first. <laughs> yeah, was that was the first road. We have been on many road trips, so that one is like. And then we went last year. We uh we both love road trips. We love road trips. You know, you probably know the last one we went to, which was. Portland, Oregon from that uh, vlog and more is coming as long as when this lockdown and quarantine is over It's gonna be more because we are longing for that. It's hard to keep track of everything. It is. It is very hard We've gone yeah. from San Diego to Mount Shasta to Portland. Yeah, and also in Europe. Las Vegas. We are also in our trip in Europe. Finland, Germany, Denmark. Poland, Germany, for Mira Luna. Denmark. Denmark, yes. And Sweden. And also yeah. up in northern Sweden to my hometown. Yeah. Yeah. But well, we love road trip. So mm -hmm. let's move on to the next question. What was the first thing you noticed about me? Well, I guess that would be the same answer as I said earlier. Your creativeness. Oh. And how you stand out from the crowd. If you're somewhere, even if it's a goth crowd somewhere, you're still going to stand out. Oh. You know? Oh, that's nice, yeah. <laughs> Standing out having your own creative style. So. Yeah, oh, that's nice, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that one. Um, yeah. Um, what is my favorite restaurant? You, you know have that? many. Mm -hmm. Your favorite restaurant in the States? Mm -hmm. Or in Sweden? I guess it can be like anywhere. Well, you're like a big steak fan, so if... Uh, yeah, I am. <laughs> if you want to say uh, a restaurant in Europe, I mean, I would say anything that has steak with the mashed potatoes. Oh, you talk about like the Swedish... Um, steak. Steak, yeah. The, um, what we call like the plank steak, I think we call it. Yeah, I haven't yeah. really seen that so much here. Yeah, but which well, one restaurant? Is... Well, I think one of your one of your favorites. It has to be the sushi place I take you to. Yeah, the sushi place. Yeah, I love sushi. Oh, the baked one. Yes, that's actually yeah. yeah that's one of the my baked sushi. I really miss going to eat at restaurants right now. I'm like, oh. And like you like crazy. besides that, not a restaurant, but you're... well, yeah, you could say like Pizza Hut. The, mm -hmm. the stuffed crust, I it's like pizza. always has to be the stuffed yeah, crust. Yeah, my favorite. Yeah. And my cooking, of course, barbecue. Yay, his barbecue is awesome. Good. Awesome. We gotta record some of that. Yeah, we really, we really, really have to do Cause that. Because we barbecue yeah. now a lot more. So yeah, when this quarantine food. is like you're, you're staying home, then what do you do? We gotta barbecue. Be, <laughs> keep ourselves occupied. Yeah, exactly. So. I um, guess sushi and hamburgers with nothing in them besides meat and bread. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm American sorry. American <laughs> food, I guess. Yeah. Exactly. And horchata. Yeah, I love horchata. Mex Mexican, Mexican food. He introduced me to Mexican food. Tacos. Taco, yes. um, what do we argue about the most? What do we argue about the most? That's tough. 
what are we gonna eat? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what are we gonna cook? That's, yeah, that one is like what we can argue about cook because sometimes you you think I meat is unhealthy. No grains. <laughs> no, I know. <laughs> I I'm the unhealthy person, and you want to eat healthy. And uh, I'm like, no, 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 I remove all the greens. <laughs> if I get a hamburger, mine's like like a big hamburger, for, yeah. for example, like Farmer Boy's. We her, argue her, about that. My burger towers over her three times because hers <laughs> is just like nothing in it. No pickles, yeah. no lettuce, mm -mm -mm. no tomato, mm. no onion. Yeah, you no. get tired of that. I think so. And one thing I think you forget that you are about to, you think I'm thinking forever to get ready. Yeah. <laughs> You're so slow and like you have to wait and wait for me. I, I, mean, I, I Well, I'm able to do so much. I'm able yeah, to do so I am much slow, while you're getting ready. Yeah, I'm the slowest person ever. <laughs> Go to the store, come back, do something else, do something yeah. else, and you're still not ready. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, this one is like a weird question, but I think that's kind of obvious. Who wear, wear the pants in the relationship? <laughs> Okay, uh, who wear the pants in the relationship? That's easy, right? I'm the only one that wears pants. <laughs> I never wear pants, kind of. Like I wear, I have, I own a few, but who, well, who wears <laughs> the tights in the relationship? That would be That's you. maybe like me, but pants. I, I really own any pants, so I don't think I've seen you wear pants ever. No, <laughs> only tights. Yeah, <laughs> dresses, skirts. Okay. Um, uh, if I am watching TV, watch I'm what I am watching. If I am watching TV, you don't really do that. Uh, no. We both don't watch TV. No, if we don't you, really if, watch TV. if you choose, I will say if you watch anything, and if it's on YouTube, which is even rare, it's some type of Victorian, like National Geographic or something, like documentary, Document, the, yeah, the, like some kind of history. Yeah, history, yeah, <laughs> makeup. Or anything that that's you too. That's like TV. I don't know if that counts, but TV, really? you don't really watch TV either. We really? don't really, we don't even own a TV. <laughs> yeah, we uh, I don't know the one that we had, we we used it once or twice, and uh, that was two yeah. years ago. Yeah, <laughs> not a fan of TV, so I like no. to watch what, and have more control of what I watch instead of <laughs> other stuff. Yeah. Uh, let's go to the next one. Uh, what is one food I don't like? And I think you already answered that one too. There's mul multiple foods. One food I don't like. Anything green, that, anything that goes from the ground, anything <laughs> healthy, anything <laughs> green. No salads, no carrots, no onions. No. <laughs> no pickles. <laughs> it just, it's, it's a long list. A long list. Any vegetable or fruit. Besides avocado and raw onion, it's like mm. that's that's it. <laughs> that's it. And the sweetest salad. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> uh, what drink do I order when we go out to eat? Oh, that's a hard one. Is that hard one? <laughs> well, you're you like the Pepsi Max. But they don't really have that. They have Max uh, style, Max, <laughs> Max influence. I don't know what you would call it. <laughs> Anything diet, if it's Diet Coke or Diet Pepsi, I guess that's a simplify. That's, yeah, that's true. Actually. And Sweden, obviously, Pepsi Max. Pepsi Max. Best drink ever. <laughs> Sweden has the smallest drinks ever. Yeah, you hate that. You hate that the small drinks in Sweden, like. Uh, the large drink is in not here, a large. I it's, know, and get to swim with him. The drinks, it's yeah. like little comparing to here. Also, <laughs> that was crazy when I came here. Also, uh, Diet Fanta. Yeah, that's good also, but I'm not drinking that, that so often. I think. Well, we're in Sweden, we do. Yeah, but they have more They have more diet options there, and they also have the, yeah. More diet and more vegan options. Yeah. Here, it's, it's, it's barely becoming something here. Yeah. And Oregon they have, but not in California, not so much. That's true. But it slowly it's becoming more normal to yeah. sell vegan. <laughs> uh, okay, let's move on to the next one. Um, what uh, size of shoe do I wear? What shoe size do I wear? That should be easy. I believe it's a women's size 8. That's kind of... Or 7. Ooh, yeah, I'm like in between. Yeah, Half. 
You are like in, I'm like thinking between the because seven I have and bots, eight. The boots I bought were eight, so that's why I was thinking eight. But yeah. it's seven and a half. Yeah, it, it depends. Like it's uh, seven or eight. But if yeah. you if if it's a, a company that doesn't make halves, you have to wear eight. Yeah, or so it depends how big. I, in the morning, true. I always wear like seven. So it, I think it depends what. what and then new rock brand. would be you need a bigger. Yeah, I use a new rock. It's small. I think European. Sizes. They don't. Sometimes they don't make halves. Anyway, yeah, so. exactly. Um, okay, what is my favorite canned kind of sandwich? The one with anything, nothing, anything that's healthy in it. <laughs> like what? Well, sandwich, mm, bagel sandwich. Mm -hmm. Those are really I good. I love bagels. It's a Philadelphia cream cheese. Mm -hmm, that's very good. With turkey or whatnot. Mm -hmm. I will say that and nothing green or anything healthy. <laughs> you mean all the meat? That's yeah, that's about, it. Yeah, that's true. With the cream cheese, not about it. <laughs> Simple sandwich. Empty, yeah, empty calories. <laughs> yeah. Um, um, what is one talent I have? Like one talent I have. One talent, uh, <laughs> Mitch, matching, I guess. You're able to put different clothes together and match it with like certain boots. Remember mm. when we travel like to Europe, you have like five or six pairs of boots. And it's like, if I wear vinyl, wear my vinyl ones, put the ground, put the ground. So it's uh, you're really good at matching and missing matching clothes I I and then uh matching the hair matching everything like a whole outfit from head to toe so yeah pretty good with with that yeah uh, i haven't really think about that though <laughs> i just think and okay that works good and I'm, i don't know it's like my brain is not thinking about well, that. so some people can wear like colors so many like, colors like, in one outfit and it just doesn't really look good there's easy you know? there's easy i'm just having black and maybe a few white like this top is one of the few <laughs> white I have. I, it's easy. But I think your talent can be endless because anything that you work on Aww. like ends up being something that you're it, it makes you it's like a strength that you oh, have. Oh that's nice. So oh that. <laughs> I will say there's many many. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Especially what you can do with your face makeup wise. Oh. Oh that's very nice. Oh so let's move on to the next question. Uh what would I eat every day if I could? Pop tarts. Pop tarts. <laughs> Pop tarts. Pop tarts. Really? Mm. Uh, I don't know. What would I what? eat every day if I could? Meat sauce. Mm. I don't know if I want to eat that every day though. Steak or some Steak. kind of salmon. Yeah, salmon. Oh, I'm craving that right now. Fika. Fika. Oh, I miss that too. Yeah. Salad. Nah. <laughs> Salad? No. <laughs> that is tomato. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, what is my favorite cereal? Your favorite what? Cereal? Cereal? I don't know if you have one. You never bought any, so I'll say. No. I I, I I don't have an answer. I don't really eat cereal. I've never seen you have. No, that's true. I don't really eat that. You know. Um, what is my favorite music? Eighties, new wave. Yeah, that's true. That's A lot true. of eighties: <laughs> Duran Duran, Depeche Mode, Blondie. Yeah. 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 80s, I guess. 80s. A lot of dark way 80s, yeah. Yeah. And what's your favorite music? That's uh, many. Many. Black metal. Black metal? Yeah. I don't know if that's my favorite. Is it a favorite? Black metal? It's hard to say a favorite. Yeah. Black metal, uh, dark wave, cold wave, 80s. Uh, heavy metal, yeah, synth pop. It's, it's yeah, synth pop. Uh, you two years too. Yeah, I think you forget. 
forgot that. I didn't forget. Mm-hmm. Well, you you have a lot of music. It's, I listen to you. See, you see what I listen to. It's, yeah. It can change. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that's metal too. Uh, that's like no, no. <laughs> <laughs> that's not uh, no. that's like one of the music uh, one of like one of like the metal genres that I don't really like <laughs> so I don't really listen to it uh, anymore no <laughs> no um, what is my favorite sports team your favorite sports team the mighty ducks Ducks? Who <laughs> <laughs> talks? <laughs> you don't watch sports, so I guess it's not relevant. <laughs> no, I, I I don't like sports. I don't watch sports, so here, yeah, right? I don't know. I mean, I don't really have any team. I mean, the only like I mean, I see when like Sweden is like some kind of championship. I guess I'm like want Sweden to win, but that's it. <laughs> but I don't know like any like specific team I have. No. No. Hmm. I don't think you have. You, I never seen you watch sport, sport either. <laughs> so no, I don't think that's like yeah. Uh, next question. Uh, what is my eye color? I don't know, green. Yeah, that that's correct. My eye colors are green, as you can see here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> And yours are brown, which you guys can't see, but his eye color is brown. And black at night. Black at night, yeah. Uh, who is my best friend? That one, I guess, is easy too for you. The duck. <laughs> what duck? Oh, I guess so. <laughs> that duck is coming here. I don't know what duck are we talking about. Yeah, yeah. Why is the duck again? I would say, hmm, this is a hard one. My best Adora one? Bat Rat and Sophie. Adora, yeah. That's actually correct also. Adora will Adora can say Adora, my best friend. Yeah. So that's it. Um who is your best friend? You have probably seen him if you saw the Barcroft video, I think. Tony. Tony. Yes, Tony. Um, oh, yeah. Tony and you, I guess. The Tony is the one that vi visit us uh, for our little tea party at the Barcraft documentary. If you guys has guys have seen that one, uh, um, what is something you do that I wish you didn't? What is something you do that I wish you didn't? There's something I do that I wish I didn't. I guess it's a better. Something that I do that I wish you didn't? Yeah, I guess that means like something that I do that you would wish I didn't. I guess the questions is kind of weird. <laughs> Takes a long to get ready. <laughs> yeah. Um, not be afraid of fire. Mm. <laughs> you love fire, like afraid of fire. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Take too long to get ready. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I guess that's something. Well, that's something that he didn't really like. Um, where I am from? <laughs> where I am? Gotham. Gotham. Mm -mm. Sweden. Sweden. Yeah. Lulia. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> the, he knows that. I think he knows both of those questions. So, um, what cake, kind of cake would you bake me on my birthday? What cake would you bake me on my birthday? Have you baked me any cake? No. No, you haven't. <laughs> but if you would. I'm not sure what kind of cake do you like. I Maybe mm. cheesecake. I think cheesecake you like. I love cheesecake. Event, Cheesecake, yeah. but to say like a birthday cake, I don't know. Cake? We really haven't really bought so many. No. So no. But what do I like? You like chocolate. That's true. Chocolate can never be wrong with me. Chocolate. No. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I would say everything with chocolate. I'm 
to die. I'm dying for that. That's like maybe maybe a Reese's cake. Oh Reese's peanut mm. butter. I love Reese's. Yeah. Maybe with caramel on top. Oh, I'm talking about that. Now you have to bake me a cake, but it's long time to, until my birthday thingy. <laughs> um, do I play any sports? Do mm, I tennis? Football, ice skating, no. Mm. Well, you you've ice skated before. But yeah. I don't know if that's considered so much. Yeah, I guess that might be considered a sport. I don't know. I tried when I was younger. <laughs> we played pool. Is that considered a sport? Uh, pool. But I think they mean like if you play like yeah, any sport, physical. like professional, like go to like trainings and stuff. No. Do they do that? No. No. I. No, he have a right about that too. And yeah, no, I'm not playing any sports. All right. And do you? That one is a hard one because I'm not really sure if you have been playing any sports. I know you don't play any sports now, but I know you have been skating, right, before? Yeah, skateboarding, rollerblading. Yeah. Football. Oh, damn. Baseball, soccer. Okay. No way. Flag football, tackle mm. football. Nah. Really? Yeah. Damn. Now you have to show me your skills. Also bike riding. I, I was oh, like, yeah. I could have been pretty Damn. pretty good now at biking. Mm -hmm. you know? That's actually I'm surprised. So there's something I didn't know. <gasps> Ooh, yeah. now you have to show me his skills in that. Hmm. Also running, I mean I was able to run fifteen miles. Ooh. Pretty fast. So. That's impressive. Look at him, yeah. Uh, okay, next one. What can I spend hours doing? Makeup. One pointer. Shopping. One pointer too. Mm, yeah, it's mm. shopping, makeup. Yeah, I guess that might be it. Mm. I guess you're right. <laughs> That's yeah. Well, I guess everything I'm spending time doing. If I start with something, I can't really stop. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, and now we come to the last question, which is: If I could live anywhere, where would it be? Well, you have lived where you wanted to live, but now. That's true. I, uh, to say the least, I would say Stockholm. Why well, I lived in Stockholm? You have lived in LA, and those are two places. Yeah. Anyway, where would we be? I guess we already are there. there I want to live. California. Uh, Los Angeles, California. So I guess we are here. <laughs> I would say if you had the choice that you can't live in California, you would live in Stockholm. Yeah. Well, I live there too. So, yeah. yeah, but I miss that too. Yeah. Uh, and you, if you were live anywhere, you wanna you wanna live like Sweden. Sweden. Lulia. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! 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 Uh, no. <laughs> I would say Stockholm would be yeah, cool. Yeah, it's nice. Well, you like it when you were there, so yeah. Yeah. There, so that we have come to the end to all the questions here, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. This is what you see, you learn new things from your partner uh, every day, every time. So, this is what's kind of interesting. So, yeah, so, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And don't forget, if you like this video, give it a th thumbs up, that makes me happy. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And see you guys in the next video. Bye!